unto you. We are coming to you via the YouTube. We have already previously recorded a segment of our show. Our show is the before and after of the black woman. However, it is also part of the Conscious Life series, Goddess Movement. We, come in t we are coming to you to offer you and to be part and share in the black woman's reform. The Conscious Life Goddess Movement wants to help direct one to self-development and self-awareness. We want to do what is needed for our rise. We all want to come together and learn and understand what is needed for that rise. For we understand that a nation can rise no higher than its base. We have information that is available to you upon your entrance. You may contact us at goddessonthemove at cox.net. That's G-O-D-D-E-S-O-N-T-H-E-M-O-V-E -E -E at cox.net. And you may join us on our Blog Talk Radio show, The Conscious Life, on blogtalkradio.com, The Conscious Life, on March the 15th. It will be our first show where we as women can come together and discuss the issues that plague our communities, but moreover, what, compl what plagues us as women that has stunted us in our growth so that we could develop into the woman that we should and also help to raise a nation that will be renowned. I, I couldn't think of another word but renowned. Again, join us at Goddess on the Move at Cox.net and blogtalkradio.com for the Conscious Life series. And if you are interested and see the need for our rise, contact us at Goddess on the Move to receive information of the class. Thank you. And before we go, we would just like to offer you a bit of the information in which we study to find ourselves approved. Here's Sister Jabaz. Thank you, Sister. <coughs> Sisters, remember how you have turned back. Repent of your little ways and return to your Savior. Amend your ways and he will return unto you and forgive you for your faults and make thee a light. For you have sinned and did a hateful thing in the sight of Allah by casting aside your more precept in which he gave you. Remember how he chose you and made you teachers and taught you how to clean yourselves from evil things. He gave you pure fuel to eat and good clothing and brought for you bracelets, earrings, neck chains, hair brooches, and head ornaments and taught you how to reform yourselves that your beauty that the devils have robbed of you might return to you again. And as long as you follow this divine law, you began to return to your beauty. Your skin became beautiful, your forms became graceful, your eyes began to sparkle with youth. Your hair began to look natural, and your health was returning to you. And everything you laid your hands to, he made it prosper. Your fame went abroad, and thine own enemies began to admire thee. Yea, moreover, our Savior took you and carried you about and amused thee from city to city, that you may know that he is thine Savior. And he hath the power to make you in heaven in the wilderness, if only you believe and obey. Thank you. Yes, that, that is so beautiful um, that we were given that opportunity, and it was a blessing unto us. And now we want to hear from Sister Janine. Thank you. Sisters, we need to be working on our, civil, on our general civilization. That is what we were instructed to do. Thank you. Absolutely. First, we understand that we have to hear, receive, and obey, and then pass on the instruction. And I doubt if it has been going on for a very long time. So, Sister Kasana. Mm -hmm. How to obtain the highest moral respect? First, be obedient to God and His apostle. Beware if 
comparable to live without unrighteousness. Second, separate thyself from those who hate intelligence and work in opposition to those who try to live a unclean life. Always have some excuse for not doing the right thing. Fault finders, these you keep away from. Now know that this world, devil civil, I'm sorry, civil, uh, I'm so sorry, civilization, is only sport and play, lying in the multiplication of wealth and children. Thank you. Yes, here we are instructed to understand how we can gain more respect, more re respect. Um, you know, and so sisters uh, that are listening, we want you to understand that this is not something that we have made up. All praises due to God. We have learned and we have been blessed to extract the understanding and what must be done. And so we come to you and offer you again to join us. You may contact us at GoddessOnTheMove at Cox.net and we will give you the information on how you can join and participate in this class. Um, it is so important, it is so important that we learn the keys to save ourselves, our children, and in general, our nation. However, it was explained to us many, many years ago that we cannot join the civilized society until we first gain a thorough knowledge of our own, of our own, which means yourself, but it also means our own, our own civilization, our own way of life, our own religion, and understand totally our own God. So we come to you, and again, we thank you uh, for tuning in. Uh, if you're listening to the sound of our voice, again, I would like to repeat that we come to you to bring the keys and information so that we will all be able to understand the direction that we need to be on in order to survive, sisters. To create, to organize, to survive, sisters. We need to come together. This is a call for all those who are interested and all of those who have the desire and understand the need that we need to reform and we need to repent because this rise is going to take a very peculiar and very particular type of black woman and in order for us to understand the black man we must understand ourselves and this is a key problem to the black woman in America understanding the black man developing successful relationships that we can develop beautiful and very well-rounded families, which includes our very beautiful and well-rounded children. If you look around you in every city, you will see destruction, blood up to the bridle of the horse's mouth. This is what was prophesied and is truly coming to pass. So join us at God, uh, contact us at God is on the move for the information on the class, because we are having class every Saturday and join us on the Blog Talk radio station for our the Conscious Life radio program where you can call in and we can talk and we can start a dialogue. This is for you and it's for me. And it came from God himself. Again, thank you and may God bless you and keep you and your families into our next meeting. We all would like to say peace be unto you.